Welcome back everyone, I'm the Depressor, and this is Card Hunter. What we last left off, we failed to defend Woodholm, but we barely survived, which is always good. And now we're going to go to Beneath the Frozen Earth, a level 7 adventure. Which right now we're level 8, so we're a little above the curve right now. Uh, the next adventure is very hard, Gary. I will be watching closely, don't make me uh, take back the Game Master cape. Oh, so does he, does he actually wear a cape? That's amazing. Cape and sunglasses. Alright. Beneath the frozen earth. High in the icy peaks of the Crystal Mountains, the Trog wizards plot to devour manflesh, seek out their caves amongst the snowstorms, and then tunnel down to raise their disgusting charnel house beneath the frozen earth. Three frosty battles. Okay. Gain adventure. Sinister, eight black creatures approach. They're each holding something called, er, uh, I don't know how to say this, but a gusarm. A gusarm is a polearm, by the way. Back in, uh, Second edition, there was pretty much like 50 bazillion different types of pole arm. Anyway, Frozen Canyon. The mountains are a freezing and foreboding place, unfit for human habitation. Villagers in the foothills greet the news of your arrival with astonishment. Some will seek to discourage you, telling you th that stories of the Trucklodite King are no more than old wives, wives' tales. You push on, and after many long and cold days of exploration, you come across the Frozen Canyon. Here in the otherwise unremarkable canyon, they are surrounded and ambushed by a truck scouting party. Okay, so we're gonna deal with trocodytes. Okay, we got two truck gougers and two truck spearmen. Spearmen are a bit weaker. Obvious maneuver. Slippery. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and start things off this way. Good job, you blocked your damage. Good job, you locked some of the damage. There we go. Is that a bit overkill? You bet it is. Okay, you are in range of getting hit. Alright, I want to go ahead and keep my caster away. I'll probably be best. Okay, that hurt, but that's okay. Now you're dead. Now you're moving in. Strong stab, failed. Okay, get some health back. Not bad. Let's go ahead and pass our turn. Slippery. Now I can move away. So I'll move over here. I'm failing the rolls now. That's okay. The spearmen are already dead. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and play some keep away for now. Hmm. Let's go ahead and do misguided heal on Star Sapphire. Good, you printed the damage, so you're back to 10. That should be enough to... Well, it would be enough, except I'm out of range to attack. So in this case, I'm just going to hang back for a bit. Go ahead and pass the turn. Um, let's go ahead and drop the regular mail. And you can actually drop the weak armor at this point. Slippery! And just stay in place. So you can see that the elf skills revolve around entirely about mobility. Just like this elf mobi mo mobility card here. Anyway, let's uh, hey, reliable mail. Cool. Lost you. Ah, crude plates. Armor 4. These, this armor doesn't prevent damage from attacks from behind. If uh, this armor prevents damage, move back 1. It took 1 damage. 
Okay, that's a little annoying. It's pretty powerful armor, though. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and do Unholy Frenzy on you. This will... This is completely safe, because I have reliable mail. Good stuff. Let's go ahead and move you up. Strong stab. Blocked. Blocked. Missed. Two damage. Chop. Succeeded. Succeeded again. Wow, this actually worked really well with spear characters. Damage again. Let's go ahead and dash up. Succeed it again. Succeed it again. Damage. Okay. That's a uh... Not doing too fantastic here. Fast turn. Let's go ahead and discard the weak armor and the wild run. Slippery. Sure, go over here. You fast turn, okay. Oh, I was an idiot. I know what I can do here. Move back. Hey, boiling armor. Say goodbye to your armor. Okay, now I can just move here. Ow. Yeah, I should have. If I had just melted armor first, I could have just killed him with a, a spell. But now I just kill them both with chopped. I'm very glad I picked up some more of those uh, melting armor uh, spells. Oh, now I'm confused. I thought they were Gusarms, but they might in fact be Glaive Gusarms. The dead trogs are curious creatures, prehistoric in appearance and barely human in form. Chest. More of that. Hey, novice boots. Don't really need them though. So what sort of boots do you have? Weak armor. Shuffle, weak armor, simple strike. Yeah, you can have that. So now I have a quick step, which is awesome. Uh, everything else is a good go. Take all and continue. More trogs. This time they are armed with. Or uh, can we just say, uh, just say spears for, for argument's sake? Yeah, spears or halberds. Uh, frozen bridge. A blizzard chills you to the bone, making progress slow and dangerous as you traverse a gl glacial field. You come to the frozen bridge. A solitary crossing. Uh, guarded by trogs. The trogs are accompanied by a trog wizard, and he will try to damage you from a distance while his allies engage you in melee. Okay. Um, the thing about Gus Arms is I believe they're spears that are actually slashing weapons. I think that's their gimmick. Kind of like Halbert. And some frame rate issues. Okay. So once again, we got some scuttlers. A wizard and a gouger. I can probably kill the wizard right off the bat, just simply because I have um, firestorm here. This is gonna hurt. Failed. What about you? Sorry for the frame rate. Failed. Okay, so the wizard's dead. I don't need to worry about him. And the, the scuttlers are practically dead. Okay, uh, what we can do here... How much health do you have? Move over here. Okay, go ahead and do righteous frenzy. Alright, so what we can do here... Move in. Ow. That's fine. I'd rather you cast that spell than anything else. Chop. Succeeded. 
Three damage. Seated. Three damage. Okay. I can't go there. Okay. This will do six damage because it's penetrating. Alright, let's go ahead and elf mobility. So this is actually blocking terrain right here. I didn't notice that. Oh, because this is the bridge. Duh. I don't know if they'll be able to step across it. That's the thing I'm a little uh, concerned about. I could block, but it's not going to help. Yes. Apparently they can uh, step across. Okay. Failed. So you take two damage and... Oh, now you're moving forward. That's not good. Ow. How much I can do here? So let's go ahead and pass turn. Ow. Ow. Failed. He succeeded. And he actually pushes him back. Okay, what we can do here... Uh, not many options here. Penetrating cut. Now... Fire spray. Failed the armor. I was it that fire spray hit him from behind, so the armor didn't apply. And uh yeah. Smack. Well, I'm doing great, except for the fact that I, I end every battle at critical health. Alright, Trogs, carrying some really sharp-looking pointy things. The icy wind uh, whips across the escarpment, freezing limbs, chilling bones, and sapping your morale. The moral desert is intensifying. You must hurry or risk never returning from this mountain. Collect loot. What do you got for me? Common weapon. Okay, don't need that. And I already have this axe, don't I? Yes, I do. Five rare. Wouldn't mind having this just for the uh, chops, but I think I could go without it. Take call and continue. They're called Fudchard Forks. Your knowledge of medieval weaponry is embarrass embarrassingly light, Gary. Frozen Grotto. As the blizzard intensifies, you are forced to seek shelter. A small cave offers some respite uh, from the life-threatening uh, conditions. Unfortunately, others have had the same idea. There are seven Trog wizards here. They are effective ranged attackers, and they will seek to keep the combat at long range. Seven wizards, huh? Can I have a firestorm? Please give me a firestorm. Frame rate! Wow, I have literally no, like... Attack cards. Which is really disappointing. This is a lot of wizards. I have a lot of Elvish mobility though. Holy cow. Okay, well what we can do... Besides watch my frame rate completely die on me. Yeah, give me one moment. I'll uh, restart fraps. Be right back. 
Alright, looks like this place is kind of weird with its frame rate. Even with it, with fraps off, it's still kind of a little wonky. Probably that's because there's just so many enemies on the screen. Who knows? In any case, I'm going to go ahead and just get going. So, move here. And attack. <laughs> Damage. Hard to block. Uh, frame rate. I like how it shows like a 3, and then it just immediately turns to 1. Uh, what else can we do here? Let's go ahead and get this Elvish mobility going. That's fine. Could be a lot worse. That's the that's the main thing. Could be a lot worse. Let's go ahead and get the stabbing going. Okay. Now the question is dash down this way. Ow. How much health are you down? Seven. You're down two. Yeah, that's what I figured. They still had a movement card. But that's okay. It's not the end of the world. You're almost out of cards. Uncle Bolt. Block it. No. Ow. They used every card they had. Okay. Start with a dissolve armor. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Okay, good, you failed it. Which also means they... Sh oh, they didn't lose the armor. They should've. They should've lost their oldest armor card, but oh well. It happens. Okay, uh, what we can go ahead and do from here... Okay. Healing burst. Heals everyone within th uh, heals all characters within three squares of the caster for three. Okay. And you prevent your own damage. Good job. Okay, you're just about out of juice there. One, two... Okay, this is dancing cut, right? Stab. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and pass because they have no cards left. Okay, discard that. Discard the walk. Okay, acid spot's gone. God, I have nothing here. Let's go ahead and see if I can kill you. Probably not. Oh, got it. Cool. Not looking too good at the moment, though. Oh. 
Really? You're just going to pass your turn? Alright, go ahead and get Unholy Frenzy up. No damage. Alright, now that I actually have armor, this is going to be a lot less painful. I'm going to you down. Go ahead and heal yourself. Okay, back to full. One damage, okay. Go ahead and pass turn. Alright, get rid of uh, regular mail. Get rid of spike mail. Get rid of a dash. I'm holding on to a dash on the on uh, sunny milk just in case. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, elven mobility. armor. Vulnerable, I take an extra point of damage. Okay, they're out of movement. That's good, because, uh... Can't really do much more than this. Let's go ahead and do Healing Presence on you. Discard a dash for now. Okay, now to heal, that's useful if I had a healing spell. Vulnerable, that's not useful. But we can do unstable bolt. Succeeded. Succeeded. Double sixes, really. That's fine. Failed. Succeeded. Yeah, unreliable block cannot stop sparks, unfortunately. But they're not really doing much damage either, so it's not that big of a deal. Righteous Frenzy. Also, something to note, anything that uh, reduces, like, block chance and stuff cannot reduce the number below one for so things like reliable hide can never go below one on the roll so they can they'll always succeed no matter what unless it's a penetrating attack so something to take in consideration you gonna use your movement card yes you are okay Go ahead and do backbiting strike. Failed. Failed. You're dead. And I prevented the damage back at me. So good. Good stuff. Yeah. 
little bit of a tedious fight, I have to say. But we're getting there. Going past turn. Um, get rid of simple bash. Get some health back. Step one, step one. Drain touch. Seated. Seated. No damage. Okay. What can we do? Failed. Failed. Quick step. Penetrating strike. Or zap, rather. Vulnerable. Ow. Okay. Your healing presence is still up. One damage! Yay! I'm not too worried about healing now, so... I'll go here. One damage. And just gonna trap you. Okay, last turn. Discard the block. Okay. Do an extra damage. So, one damage again. <laughs> Die! Almost there. There we go. Battle over. Now it's a good thing those these these despite being wizards, they only had only their strongest spell only did about four damage, so it wasn't too bad. Could have been a lot worse if they had spells like I don't know Big Zap and stuff. Melvin, did you know that most of these weapon names actually mean the same thing? You must uh, shelter here until the blizzard recedes before calling off the search and returning to town. If there was something here, it was has it has long gone. But a coven of Trog wizards is a remarkable and strange thing. Inquiries with the wizard Aloizo may reveal something further. Oh man, Aloizo again. Collect loot. And get some experience. We don't get as much experience because we're actually above the level right now. Okay. And stuff we already have. Possess shoes. Um... The only benefit here is the unmovable, which will make it so you don't, um... You can't be forced to move through, like, telekinesis and stuff. White shield, uh, good for blocking magic. And that's about it. Okay. Yeah, that's about all we can work with. Take all and finish. Ah. The wizard Aloizo believes he has found the location of the Trog King. He is hiding on an island off the coast. Okay. So, the throne of the strength, uh, the strength is up next, I guess. Alright, so I am the Depressed Eeyore, this is Card Hunter, hopefully you guys enjoyed it.